We all do it. Head to the ATM for some cash. But did you know you could be ripped off without even knowing it? Criminals are using fake card slots to steal your money. They're called skimmers, and they lift information from your card's magnetic strip. But how can you tell if you're getting ripped off? KTLA's Dave Malkoff has more in tonight's Money Smart. Are you money smart when you're at the ATM? What you think is part of the machine could be a piece of equipment owned by a criminal stuck to the ATM to steal your debit card. It's called an ATM skimmer. Law enforcement found this one in the San Fernando Valley and alerted security blogger Brian Krebs. That source and I have worked together on a few occasions in the past. Brian is protecting his source on this, but late tonight we independently verified that an LAPD detective is indeed investigating this particular skimmer found near Victory and the 405 in Van Nuys. They tell us everything Brian's reporting on this is correct, including the photos he's sharing through his blog. Technologically speaking, this one wasn't uh, that sophisticated, um, but it did a really nice job of combining the, the skimmer, the card skimmer itself, and the actual uh, video device to record your pin. The skimmer reads your card in a tiny pinhole camera, records your fingers entering your pin number. The crook then comes back for the skimmer, downloads the information, makes a new card, and cleans you out. What the fraudsters do is put a fake card acceptance slot right over top of the real one. Brian tells us he's seen more remote control skimmers outfitted with cell phone guts. They wirelessly transmit the stolen information back to the crook. It'll say, oh, here's the here's the card number information and here's their pin. Our number five way to protect yourself, simply cover the pin pad with your hand. You know, so that something overhead and to the side or whatever can't see your pin as you're entering it. But beware, some newer skimmers can get around that with something like this. So it's essentially a fake pin pad on top of the actual pin pad. Number four, it sounds silly, but go ahead and yank on the ATM before you use it. Something could come off. And if it does, you should probably just leave it there. <laughs> That's because these professional-grade skimmers sell on Internet forums for up to $10,000. You don't want to anger a crook who could be nearby. Just take a picture. Number two, beware of gas pump skimmers as well. Those are much harder to spot because crooks can get inside the pump. Until very recently... You know, there were about four master keys that opened like 90% of the gas pumps out there. And our number one tip, watch your bank statements. A lot of times uh, the, first, the first indication of fraud is when customers report stuff like this. You can see the skimmers for yourself by scanning the TV now or head on over to ktla.com slash Dave. With your Money Smart Report, I'm Dave Malkoff, KTLA 5 News.